to the channel. What's up guys, Oface here, and today we are going to be talking about a new upcoming video game. It is The Walking Dead, made by Overkill. And no, I am not talking about the predecessors, this is a whole new game developer, guys. The game itself is set to come out this fall, 2018. We're going to go ahead and just jump into this trailer, let's see what it's got going on. Ooh, may, may contain content inappropriate for children. Skybound. Starbreeze. 505. I ain't heard about them in a while. It's been a quick minute since I've seen one of theirs. You know, just starting off, first thing I'm noticing. Yo, bro, why don't you pick up some groceries on the way This back, quality right? kind of looks and amazing. Of broke. Amazing. Son, while you're living in DC, we have to set some ground rules when your brother comes Now, stay with I know this is a cutscene, but if this game even looks half as good as what this trailer does i'd venture to say this is going to be a good game golly he is getting nagged big time guys big time well that just changed looks like uh the t-virus just hit resident evil pun guys hopefully hopefully you walking dead fans will forgive me on that one Man, look at that. You can see the water, the detail. Oh, man. This this is going to be a really good game. I have a I have a good feeling. It's rough looking. You think the city would be the last place people would want to be after this outbreak because there's going to be tons of people, especially in Washington. I'd venture to say if there was an outbreak, we'd have a lot of people going to Washington because there's going to be a lot of military presence, you know, for the president. Aiden don't care. Look at that. He is just taunting him. That's a new style of bat. That don't look like no Lucille. Sick. Sick. Get him, son. Get him. Nice. I like it. I like that a lot. Unreal Engine. I don't know if you guys caught that, but this game is being developed on the Unreal Engine. For those of you that don't know, that is also the engine that they are making Sea of Thieves on. For any of my previous videos, if you guys check it out, the quality of that game is, it's just, oh, it's just perfect, perfect. The water is amazing, everything looks great. I fully expect this game to come out and look just as amazing as it does in that cutscene. Hopefully as good as it does in the cutscene, I'll say. Most games don't match up to their cutscenes, but I believe with the Unreal Engine, we could see some really good gameplay. Really good. Let's go ahead and move on to the website. Check this out. Okay, and here we are on the website. Um, as you can see, you've got a zombie on either side, surrounded by four people. One of them we know is the trailer we just saw. So I could only assume that the other three people are characters we're going to be able to play. Now, this middle character, that man, he he kind of looks like an older Rick. I mean, I'm not going to go ahead and say that's what it is, because it's probably not, but he definitely looks like an older Rick. Definitely. As I said earlier, Overkill makes this game. It's coming this fall. You guys should uh, check out this website. I'm going to go ahead and put it in the description. For those of you that just saw that trailer for the first time, definitely go back, check it out in 1084K see what you got going on because it it really really i don't know if my video will do justice like the main trailer and you always want to support the creator i will definitely be pre-ordering this game it looks really good really good a little more details about the game it looks like overkills the walking dead is a four player co-op action fps nice nice guys uh 
I get the feeling it's going to be similar to the division gameplay. You've got a group of four. Don't know if you'll be able to see anybody else in the game, but it seems like it'll at least be similar to the division in the Walking Dead universe. Where you and your friends fight the dead as well as the living. So you may be able to fight other people in this game and not, uh, not just run through the mobs. Hopefully uh, you'll have some online live action. It'll make it interesting. Maybe have some saviors out there. You know what I mean? Set in the Walking Dead universe, you and your group will try to survive in a post-apocalyptic Washington, D.C. Oh. I don't know if we will make it. But my gosh, we will try. Each character has their own special abilities, skill trees, squad roles, play styles, and story arcs. But teamwork is paramount. The action is close up and intense. Take out enemies carefully with silent melee attacks or go in guns blazing sun. You know that's how I play. You know that's how I play. With your choice of each class firearms, you need to be able to improvise as nothing is certain and a horde of walkers is always right around the corner. Gosh, I don't know about you guys, but I am definitely going to pre-order this as soon as it comes out. This sounds great. I'm pretty excited. Pretty excited. I really enjoyed The Division. I like the gameplay in it, and I feel like this is going to be very similar. It's made on the Unreal Engine, which is amazing. Really good engine for video games these days. Um, I'll probably get it on PS4, even on Steam. You know, I'm a PC player, PS4 at heart. Still do a little Xbox, so don't hate on me, guys. Don't hate on me. Let's go on down and see what all they offer this on. All right, all right, guys. It looks like this is going to be coming to PC, Xbox, and PS4. So I am in luck. It's going to work on all the consoles. Uh, we will definitely, like I said, we're going to go ahead and jump into this game. We are definitely going to pre-order it, and I'm going to have some beta action on here for you guys. So, uh... Hopefully you guys subscribe, like this channel, keep up with me because we'll be jumping through this game quite a bit. I am really, really excited about this. We're just going to go ahead and wrap this up, guys. For those of you that are just joining in, this is The Walking Dead game. We went ahead and went over that trailer. That trailer looks great. Again, it's going to work on all four consoles. It's a first-person shooter. First-person shooter, guys. We're finally getting a real Walking Dead game. Finally. Uh, Four-player co-op, hopefully online with other players. We will see. We will see. That's to be determined. They haven't, they haven't let out that information yet, but hopefully we'll hear something here soon, and I will definitely be updating it on my channel. Um, the other Walking Dead, just before anybody says anything, I know I said this was the first real Walking Dead. The other Walking Deads were good. Don't get me wrong, I really did enjoy them. The story was great on them. I like that you got to kind of choose your own adventure. You got to make the choices you wanted. That determined how the story played out. Telltale did a really good job on that game. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of the way they did the, uh, how do you say, uh, cartoonish graphics. Not really cartoonish. More like a uh, comic book graphics style. It was, it was a neat game. It had a really good story. I went through all of them, enjoyed it big time. In all honesty, though, I was really feeling a FPS game for The Walking Dead. It has needed it for the longest time. I'm, I've got a lot of faith in this game. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, guys, if you're going to get them, get them in the face.